Hi, I'm B. I'm 20 years old, and although I'm from the South East, I'm currently up here studying media performance at Salford University and also Media City UK. So why do I think your Blue Peter viewers would like me? Well, I am fun, I'm energetic, I'm excitable. Um, I also think I can relate to your audience because I've worked with children of all ages and abilities, and also I'm still a massive kid at heart, so I think that helps. I have never grown out of the dream of being a Blue Peter presenter, so I've made a DIY project for you and hopefully you enjoy it and thank you so much for watching. Hi and welcome back to Create It with me, B. and today we have a Christmas theme here and we are going to be making these gorgeous door handles to let Santa know where to leave your presents. But today we are going to be making a penguin with this. So you can get this pack on our website and it has in it three door hangers so you can make them for all of your friends if you want and a stop here sign some felt shapes to make the thing you want and some little sequins and decorations to finish it off with. So you start off with your felt door hanger and you get the big shape and this one is the penguin and they have sticky back plastic on them so you take off the sticky back plastic like so, should all come off in one and then you stick it on the middle of the felt door hanger. And don't worry, although it is sticky and will stay, it's also got a little bit of flexibility so you can move it around if it's not exactly where you want it. The next thing you'll need is his little Santa's hat. Again, you can make this out of felt by yourself if you want to, make sure you get an adult to cut it out for you. Just use a bit of PVC glue or sticky back plastic to put it on. Now you're going to put his little face on and his belly. Now you can make these out of white felt, just like you made the hat. And how are you doing? I'm sure yours is coming on and looking great. Now I'm using little yellow feet that come with this because I think I want it to look like a proper penguin and we don't want it to be cold and have no socks on. Now we're going to put his beak on so that he can talk. So there we go, and he should now look like this. So you can leave this little fella exactly how he is. I think he's cute and he looks like he's come out of an igloo in the Arctic. But I'm going to stick on some little sequined icicles. Now I'm going to use some PVA glue because it is washable and kid friendly. You can get it from any good craft store or even supermarkets. Now I'm just pouring a little bit of this onto the excess sheets so that I can dunk it in without getting my fingers messy. You can use little cotton buds if you want to, to avoid getting excess on your fingers. But isn't all the fun of making things getting a little bit messy. So, it's going to be white, but don't worry because it dries clear. And I'm just sticking him just above his little hat. And I'm going to stick one on the other side to make it equal. And you can stick as many as you want. You can stick one on his hat if you want to. I'm going to leave it with those two. So you can see the glue on there, but it will dry clear. Just like this one here that I made earlier. And then the gingerbread man too. So these are my three finished Christmas door hangers. I hope you like them as much as I do. And I'm going to give them to my brothers and have this one on my door. Please send me pictures of the ones that you have made. And you can make any design that you want. Snowmen, baubles or even a candy cane. That's what I'm going to do later. So thank you very much for joining. Bye from me and have a very Merry Christmas.